carrying on from my previous video that introduced the iPod Touch 8GB to get your iPod going the first thing you're going to have to get is what's known as the iTunes now it's easier to go on a normal computer and get yourself the iTunes download you can use your iOS 5 device like your iPod or your iPhone to get it but it's easier just to use an ordinary computer so the first thing you want to do is go onto the internet and type in www.apple.com on the address bar so once you've got that this is what will come up this is what it looks like at the minute uh, it's just advertising it's iPhone 4s so along the top you've got a sub menu so let's go across there we've got store Mac iPod iPhone iPad iTunes that's what we want so let's click on that and this is what we'll bring up so but what we're interested on here is the free download of the iTunes so it's the version is 10.5 at the minute in January 2012 so it's for Mac or a PC personal computer so you want to download that click on it and then it'll take a while go through all the process and you might get this bar at the bottom on Windows Vista saying downloading if you click on it say open Anyway, once you've done all that, gone through all this gobbledygook, I'll show you what it looks like. You'll get this iTunes icon on your desktop. Okay, so once you've got that, double click on it. Once you've double clicked on it, it will open up like this. Okay, that's the basic iTunes. Now, that's the store that we're on at the minute, the shopping store. And over on your left here, you've got all these sub -eddings music films but the one we're highlighting here is the store that's what's on at the minute okay so the stores to tell you about all the music if you look across the sub headings here we've got home let's click on home it should be the music but we'll click on it anyway see the progress bar across the top there yeah that is the home page is the music store anyway and the over on the right here you've got the the charts who's at number one we've got Flow Rider with feeling uh, good feeling and we've got uh, Teo Cruz with Troublemaker at number two so that's a singles chart anyway we'll go back over here on the left hand side so we've looked at the store the Apple store sorry about my camera movements I'm getting used to the camera over on the left on this iPod let's go back up here so we've got music which is the home one anyway films TV programs or oh, the app store here applications so let's have a click on that there's the progress bar we'll open up in a minute okay so this is the application store the app store again we've got this top charts uh, have a look here all these sub -eddings. Let's just scroll the page down. And these are a list of all the free apps if you want to have a look at some of those. Uh, top grossing, which is a combination of paid and freebies. Let's have a look at number one at the minute. Football manager. Top grossing. The top free one is Kick Messenger, social networking. And we've got Keep Calm and Carry On. What's this? entertainment that's the top selling app at the minute so there's your sub headings we can go along here we can go to books podcasts iTunes U talk about that later on so going back over to the sub headings here let's go the next one you want to go to is if you if you've got any apps you've bought any apps there should be some inbuilt ones but there's, there's going to look like there's a lot on here because I've got quite a few so I'm going to click on that and as I do this will change Now, as you can see there a lot of icons um, okay some of them are a bit goofy I just was getting the free apps to look at Christmas ones and have a bit of fun but some of the ones I'll recommend later on individually but in the meantime let me just show you a good one to get um, a good free one um, looking for it there it is look Gibson learn and master now how do you get that 
Well, let's go to the App Store again. Where are I? There. Go to the iTunes Store. Click on that. Gibson Learner Master. That's what we're going to look in. Make sure we're on the App Store. And we're going to type in the search, which is up here. Gibson Learn and Master. Okay, enter. Is it going to do anything? Yep, okay. So the progress bar has brought up these suggestions. There's the one. It says downloaded because I've already downloaded this one and it was a free application at the time. Let me click on it. Progress bar. It'll come up. There we go. And it's still a free application. It's just changed to downloaded. At the end of there, let's have a look at the end of there, what options it gives. I've just clicked and you can tell a friend, you can copy the link, you can share on Facebook or share on Twitter. Anyway, to get it for free, you click on where it said free there. And then over across here somewhere, it'll have this little circle going round and round saying it's downloading. And then later on it will be in your apps. So if you check in your apps, there it will be. Looking like mine. So if I click on my apps. It's a bit slow as my computer today. Okay, that's what you'll have. So, but when you get any applications, whether you buy them or whether they're free, check that they are compatible with the iPhone, sorry, with your iPod Touch. Now, to do that, let's go back to the store again. So, I'll go back to the store. Uh, down here, requirements, compatible with iPhone, iPhone, iPod Touch and iPad requires iOS, which is, um, I think the i is intelligent operating system for or later. So we've got iOS 5, so it's later than that, so that's fine. So anyway, I look out for my next video. I shall continue on. Thank you very much for watching.